Hello everyone, welcome to Pinnacle Math Mania. My name is Captainess123 and today we will be working on selecting the more appropriate unit of measure of mass. Dylan and Timothy go to the tuck shop and are trying to figure out which items can be measured in grams and which can be measured in kilograms. Let's help them decide. Dylan purchases a sausage roll and asks Timothy, grams or kilograms? Timothy thinks for a while and says grams. He's correct, a sausage roll is made up of a little bit of matter, so it will have a low mass and can be said to have a mass in grams. The tuck shop lady then chimes in and says, yes, my sausage rolls are all made same and each is 50 grams. I measure the ingredients myself. Timothy then purchases a small bottle of water. He turns to Dylan and asks, grams or kilograms? Dylan immediately shouts out, grams! And he is also correct. Remember, if the sausage roll measured to be 50 grams, a small bottle of water, which is also made up of a little bit of matter, will also have a fairly low mass. The tuck shop lady chimes in again and says, yes, you are correct. That bottle of water has 250 milliliters of water in it, which is the same as 250 grams. But you, my boy, your mass will be in kilograms. You're made up of a lot more matter than what I have here to sell. Wow, Dylan and Timothy were only discussing grams and kilograms, but also just learned that one milliliter is equal to one gram. They ran out of the tuck shop very quickly to go tell the rest of their friends. Think of the items in your school's tuck shop. Would they be measured in grams or kilograms? Thank you for visiting Math City today. Try the exercises on pinnacle.com to earn points and win great prizes.